Here we have to find the general solution of second order differential equation. And at first we're gonna isolate y double prime. That's gonna be y double prime equals to negative x times y prime squared and minus y prime and over x. And now we're gonna substitute that y prime equals to v and therefore y double prime equals to v prime, where v is a function of x. Uh, so we get that v prime equals to negative x times v squared and minus v and over x. Therefore, derivative of v with respect to x equals to x times v squared minus v and over x. So now the equation is of the form a first order Bernoulli differential equation, which is has the form y prime plus p of x times y and equals to q of x times y to the power of n. And so and now and our equation is v prime minus one over x times v and equals to negative v squared. So the general solution is obtained by substituting u equals to v to the power of 1 minus n and solving 1 over 1 minus n times u prime plus p of x times u and equals to q of x. So now we put that u equals to v to the power of negative 1 Therefore, we get a negative u prime minus u over x equals to negative 1. And we multiply both sides by negative 1 and we get u prime plus u over x equals to 1. So now we uh, rewrite it into form of first order linear differential equation. So that's form u of u prime of x plus p of x times u equals to q of x and in our case p of x equals to 1 over x and q of x equals to 1 so now we can find integrating vector that can be e to the integral of 1 over x dx and that's equals just to x and now we have u of x times x equals to integral of 1 times u of x dx and that's going to be integral x dx which is equal to x squared or 2 plus c sub 1 therefore u of x equals to x squared or 2 plus c1 or x so that's going to be x squared plus 2c1 over 2x and let 2c sub 1 be just c therefore we get that v of x equals to 1 over u over x u of x and therefore this is going to be 2x or x squared plus c and now we substitute back the values of v of x equals to y prime so we get that y prime of x equals to 2x over x squared plus c. Therefore, derivative of y with respect to x equals to 2x over x squared plus c. Therefore, dy equals to 2x over x squared plus c dx. And we integrate both sides. So we get that y plus c sub 2 equals to log of x squared plus c and here we can find our y which is log of x squared plus c and minus c sub 2 and that's going to be our answer.